subterranean boat show. guys always done like lights even in like practicing and such um yes. <laughs> not every time but we got underway with it i think generally I think when our practices have had like, probably not the first one because okay. usually yeah. the first night it's like getting used to the space yeah. but yeah i have uh, i have my own studio and a lot of lights and projectors and all kinds of fun stuff that i've collected over the years and it seems to uh enhance the mood when we just get the lights low, turn on some stuff. Ovi was talking about what we shot tonight. It's just like string of purple lights over your drum, just toss them over there and it adds some ambiance. Yeah. Um, but we've been doing that for a while, right?
so the ambiance is very important. Yeah, and, I agree. Uh, our, our, one of our uh, working methodologies in the lab is uh, always look at the center of the screen. Yes, it's good advice. Look at the center of the screen. Yep. <laughs> when, uh, when we're practicing, if uh, we put on some suitably psychedelic effects on the screen, the, mand the mandalas are particular favorites. Uh, not that these guys are ever at a loss for inspiration, but uh, it's always good to keep in mind, look at the center of the screen. Yeah. Stare at the sun. Something comes out of that. That's for sure. Everything will make sense. Yes, everything suddenly <laughs> makes. It's very unusual, isn't it? Very <laughs> unusual. If you stare at the center of a trippy screen while you're playing trippy rock music, <laughs> try it out. Try it. Try it out there. Viewers at home. Viewers at home. Viewers at home. Call, call my Be boss. sure to comment below and yeah. tell us how your experience was. Yeah. <laughs>